Hey ya people, Andrew here again. Today I'm going to be reading Dogman Grime and Punishment by Dave Pilkey, the ninth book. As you see, uh, I've uploaded this video before, two videos, but they, saw, they got abandoned and I had to delete them. Okay, but anyways, let's start. Dogman Grime and Punishment. Georgian Hero, Celebrities at Large. Intro 1. Hey, yeah, pals, it's your boys, George and Harold. Sup? As you see, the 10th book, um, the 10th book has been released, but, um, but the book doesn't have, um, the book doesn't have, a, um, intro, <clears throat> and, um, <clears throat> and, um, a thus far one. <clears throat> but it has a meet the cast. Hey, yeah, pals, it's your boys, George and Harold. Sup? You're not, you're not going to believe this, but we got totally famous. But we totally got famous. It all started last week when we were selling our comics at the mall. Hey, you can't peddle your wares here. We're not peddling wares. Yeah, I never peddled a ware in my life. Hey, what's a ware? Beats me. I'm calling the cops on you mail factors. And so, what's all this then? These delinquents are conducting elect transactions. Illicit transactions. Hmm. We be we'd better check this out. Ha 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 ha. Hey, these comics are awesome. Thanks. We have a special discount for cops. Yeah. Three for five bucks. Okay, I'll take three. Give me six. Ka-ching. Zong. Ka-ching. Aren't you gonna arrest them? Relax, Sherlock. They're just kids. The cops told everybody about our comics. And soon the crowds grew and grew. The Daily News. Mall is popular again, thanks to Juvenile's comics. What shall we do about these two kids? I know, let's give them free food and stuff. <clears throat> and so. <clears throat> thanks for a root beer float, Sherlock. My name's not Sherlock. I've totally told you like 50 times. Well, well, we better get started on our next comic. Our public awaits. While we work on our next tale of depth and maturity, check out our story thus far. <laughs> Intro 2. Dogman, our story thus far. One day, there a cop and a police dog got hurt in an explosion. Pop. <laughs> wee you, wee you, wee you. They got rushed to the hospital, where the, but the doctor had sad news. Boo-hoo. Sorry, cop, dude, but your head is dying. Oh, darn it. And your body's dying, doggy dude. Why, why, why? But then, but then the nurse lady got a super lit idea. I know, let's stitch the dog's mm, head on the cop's, mm, onto the cop's body, onto cop's body. You're a genius, nurse lady, I know. And so they had a big operation. And that's how a dog been started. <clears throat> dog kept the city safe from evil doors. Rats. Till one day when everything everything changed. <clears throat> hey Papa. <clears throat> Be the world's most evilest cat. <clears throat> was transformed by love. And now he's a good guy. <clears throat> but even though Petey's heart has changed, his mind is still haunted by the ghost of his past. Petey, I am your father. Hey, this didn't happen. If Petey's going to continue to do good, he might need a little help from his friends. I barely know these people. So sit back and enjoy our newest epic graphic novel. It's only a comic book. Chapter 1, Chief's Big Day. <clears throat> good afternoon. I'm Mayor. Thank you for joining us on this nice session. We are here to honor Chief for being the best chief in town. Yay, hurry, hurray, hurray, yippee. <clears throat> Isn't he the only chief in town? Shh. Here to present the award is Chief's very best friend, Dogman. Hooray, yay. Clap, 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 clap. Chief rocks, yeah. Clap, 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 clap. Where is he? <clears throat> he was just here a minute ago. <clears throat> I think he's outside digging up those flower beds. My roses. Oh, uh, don't worry, Mayor. Dog would never do anything like that. Oh, dog man. 
Listen, here it comes now. <clears throat> My roses! How could things get any worse? No! <clears throat> Little Rama time. <clears throat> Bad doggy. Give me back my glasses. <clears throat> Don't cry, Mario. Just I'm not crying. He slobbered all over my glasses. He got grime all over my new suit. And he dug up my rose garden. <clears throat> Sniff, sniff. If that doghead cop messes up one more time, I'm going to take his badge away. Don't worry, sir. Don't just get excited. That's all. He'll be good from now on. Well, I should hope so. What now? Where's my hat? Hey, my hat! Rip, rip. Tom, quick, give me that hat. Give it. Let go, seriously. Rip. Crack. Crack. Run! Croof. Russell, Russell, Russell. <laughs> Swish, snap. Dog man! Come back here with the hat! Chapter 2. The saddest chapter ever written. <clears throat> that night. Ding dong. What do you want? And what's he doing here? I thought I told you to get rid of that guy. But Mayor, please, don't Mayor, please me. That dog head cop is a nuisance. If you won't fire him, I will. Give me your badges. You're fired, dog man. Now get off my lawn. <clears throat> you see, Mr. Snookums? I told you I was a powerful person. Yes, sir, everyone listen to me. Because I'm the best mayor in town. Good night, Mr. Snookums. Look, without even taking the badges, he just, he just left it outside. That was dumb. <laughs> We're not going to cry, okay? We're going to be brave. We'll just go in your here, and we'll, we'll walk to your desk, and we'll pack up your things. So you'll always remember us. Here's the bone that you like to chew. Here's your squeaky toy telephone. Squeak, squeak. <clears throat> And here's a little ball. Oh, you love to. I'm not going to cry. I'm not going to. I'm not going to. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, wow. Gee, Chief's really crying. I'm, I'm, I'm not, n -n not crying. Just allergies. <clears throat> I think I've got allergies too. Me too. Whoa, we're allergic to sadness. Blah, 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 blah. Hey, what's going on here? Splish, splash. <laughs> Don't just got fired. Well, I'm not surprised. Yeah, Dung was an awful cop. I know he chewed up my new phone. And he pooped in my filing cabinet again. Aren't you ashamed of yourself? Splish, splash, splish, splash. Look what you've done. You made everyone cry. And you broke Chief's, and you broke Chief's heart. Get out of here, dog man, and don't come back. Splish, splash, splish, splash. Ow, Chapter three. The chapter that's that's totally not as sad as the last one. It's okay, ADHD. We can make the tree red. It's our star. We can color it any way we want. Hey, look, down in his home from... What's wrong, dog man? Did you get trouble at work again? What happened? Oh, 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 You did? Oh, 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 He did? Oh, oh. You can't? Hmm. I've got an idea. We'll help you get your job back. Don't worry about a thing. Just come upstairs. 
and lie down on your bed. I'll read you a bedtime story. Now read you a bedtime story. I wrote the words and ADHD drew the pictures. Are you ready? Here is Dogman. We put a dogman by the tree. <clears throat> we had a dream, but it wasn't scary. Look at us. We are on the world. Do you like Dogman? We do. Now it's nighttime. The end. He's asleep. <clears throat> Come on, ADHD, we've got work to do. Flip, flop, flip. Meanwhile, in another part of town, someone else was hard at work, too. If I can just connect these tubes to hyperdrive, then my newest invention will be Itsy Bitsy Spider went up the water spout. Down came the rain and washed the spider out. Up came the sun and would you cut that out? Why do you have to be so annoying? It never fails. Every time I'm working or reading or sleeping, you're jumping up and down on the bed or singing a stupid song or telling one of your pointless stories. Last time you read, you woke me up to ask me what my favorite color was. I've had it up to here with you. But wow. Wah, 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 wah. Uh, at last, check out my very last in invention, the Mighty Motor Brain. Wah, wah. Are you ready to test it? Why do you have to be so mean, Grandpa? I thought you liked me. I never said I liked you. I said I needed you. Do you, you do? Of course I do. Pat, pat, pat. I need you to be my guinea pig. Guinea pig? Certainly. The mode, the motor brain has never been tested. It might be dangerous. That's why I need to try it out on you. But, but Grandpa, is this thing safe? Ah, oh, don't worry, Big Jim. It'll be fine. Now, let's turn this baby on. Click. Put, 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 put. What's it supposed to do, Grandpa? It's a personal and flyer. It takes your own. It takes your own innermost pipe and multiplies it ex exponentially. Now let's turn this dial up to eleven, and let's see what happens. <gasps> How do you feel, Big Jim? Me not Big Jim. Me snug and snug feel like. Ah, no. no way. <laughs> snug, oh, grandma. Snug, feet, but snug, no, no feet. Snug, pet kitty. Snug, pet kiss kitty. Snug, cuddle, cuddle kitty. Snug, love kitty. Help. What? Wham. What's this? A secret escape room? <laughs> Chapter 4, The Dog in the Hat. <sighs> Meanwhile, while Dogman was still sound asleep, Yellow Petey and ADHD were upstairs in the all room completing their newest invention. Okay, ADHD, let's test it out. Click. Meow. Hiss. Click. And now for the, now for the final test. Wake up, Dogman. Flip, flop, flip, flop, flip. Me and ADT made a new invention. Let's test it. Uh, let's try it on. Flop. Cool. You still look like a cat, dogman. If you press your right ear, you can talk like a cat. Click. Meow. Now try your other ear. Hiss. Click. Now we just need one last detail. I'm a cat. Perfect. Ding dong. Doorbell. Ruff, 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 ruff. Flip, flop, flip, flop. Ruff, 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 ruff. Flip, flop, flip, flop. Oh, hi. Ruff, ruff. Oh, hi, Papa. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Slurp, slurp, slurp. Hug, hug, hug. Stop it. Nobody, not everybody likes to be paying slobbered on, you know. Sorry, Papa. Look, it's okay if you do it. But what's his problem? That's dog man. I know it's Dogman. Why is he dressed up like that? 
Oh, because he got fired last night. And Chief isn't allowed to hire dogs anymore. So he turned him into a cat. Nobody's going to believe that he is a cat. They won't? No, he looks ridiculous. We've got to help him, Papa. All right, all right. Here's some advice. Don't roll in any dead fish. And quit sticking your tongue out. Wow, he looks better already. Problem solved. All right, kid, let's go get some gelato. Okay. Bye-bye, Dogman. Good luck. Chapter 5. A, do a bunch of stuff that happened next. Soon. Knock, knock, knock. Hey, Chief, my thanks over to you about the new job. Blah. Let me read Buster. Sniff, sniff. Splash! Wow! Splish, splash, splish, splash, splish, splash, splish, splash. Wow, 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 wow. Why, why, why? Hmm. <gasps> Clomp. Hey! Do that! You let go of that right now! Rip. Crash. Hey! Plop. Meow, 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 meow. Click, 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 click. Is it you? <gasps> the dog bin, you can't be here. The mayor ever finds out. Hey, chief, mayor's here. <sniffs> Plop. Shh. Why is it so damp in here? Well, uh, you see, we, um, uh, never mind that. Have you found a replacement for Dogman yet? Oh, gee whiz, mayor, we have only what about him. A cat-headed man would be perfect. So clean, so smart, and he has nine lives. We should hire him. Well, okay. Awesome. I think I have Doc and Joel's badge in my pocket. Aha! Ah, here it is. Well, look at that. It fits perfect. Congratulations. Welcome to the force. Hey, solved another problem. I can't wait to go home and tell Mr. Snookums. Oh, boy, this is going to be great. Meanwhile, how's the Gelto? Good. Hey, start building a new robot this weekend. I could really in, in use your help this week. I can't. Why not? I mean, with my common club this week. <sighs> well, look, robots are more important than comics. Why? Because we need robots for protection. 